Hello everyone. My name is Natalie Pelto. I'm the founder of Essential Modern Day Healers, EMD Healers for short. And I'm doing this beautiful recording for you guys to know how to maximize your kits that you guys have purchased through doTERRA and how to get the best value by using the Lifestyle Pyramid. Now, um, if you don't know what the Lifestyle or Wellness Pyramid is, likely you have probably seen it. Um, it looks like this. And it is what hopefully you were exposed to in your class. If you have not been exposed to it in your class, it's totally fine. And we will onboard it right now and really get a good chat about it. And oh, look at how much it changes my color. Um, but yeah, we're gonna really talk about how to use your top 10 oils. And we're gonna talk just briefly about a new product uh, because the foundation of the pyramid is actually nutrition. But this is a way for you guys to go back to your kit and not feel so lost, not feel so like you have bought something that you are not going to use. I want you guys to use it and I want everyone to use it. That's why this video is actually made um, live. So um, I'm a certified nutritional therapist, certified detox specialist, and I am a nutrition for cancer prevention and longevity advisor. I'm also a frontline worker in healthcare and diagnostics. So I work on both ends of the spectrum all the time and doTERRA has obviously become my newfound passion. But now saying that, understanding how to bridge in natural health when you're used to allopathic medicine, which is Western medicine, can sometimes be a bit of a challenge. So we're gonna talk about that briefly today because these videos are all meant to be very, very short, but we're gonna just show you a quick tip that I educate people in their first wellness consult with me, um, just about how to use their lifestyle pyramid and to have weekly goals Goal setting is huge when you're, it's coming to it when we're dealing with our health because it may be the, the difference between success and failure. If you, especially if you do not have that support of someone that is working and doing the actions with you. Because sometimes, let's face it, we are kind of journeying on this journey on our own at first. The ripple effect of how you feel will attract maybe your significant other to join on your journey, your children. It has a powerful impact on everyone. So let's start off with the Pyramid of Health and how this is going to work. So this Pyramid of Health can be printed off Google. That's how easy it is to acquire. You print it off and you can actually, if you want to save the trees, guys, keep just one. And then just inventory every single week. And I don't know why my light is doing this to me. Here we go. Let's try that. Um, but you can just inventory every week and just bring awareness to the area you need most, most help in. Because as humans, as habit-driven creatures, we tend to want to stick to what we're good at because hab habitually, that's what we're good at. Our brain knows that is a pattern it can do. And so having this bridging in this whole new system I don't want to say that it's going to be difficult, but it may take some time. So this is one way to do it. So how do we use the wellness pyramid in this way? Every week you will actually take this and you will look at the wellness pyramid. And as you can see, we have eat right, we have exercise, manage stress, toxic load, informed self-care, and proactive medical care. Now, what you want to be doing with this is actually rating yourself on a scale of 1 to 10 on how comfortable and how confident you are in the space of health. So, for example, if you are a 10 in the Eat Right department, you're going to want to actually usually focus in that area. But really what you should be doing is possibly focusing on, and you're like a 5, let's just say, on the rest and manage stress because you have a very stressful job or you run a daycare or you are responsible for you know dealing with largest amounts of stresses either healthcare wise whatever whatever it is your jam we are all exposed to stress these days stress is 95 is considered to be the lead cause of most disease so if you're a five here I'm not telling you to stop doing what you're doing here but we're gonna really start to really hone in and focus for the next week on this space and you know, maybe next week you'll be, you'll, so, and you want to be 10 being like, you're the best. So maybe the week after when you look on the Sunday and I do this every Sunday, it takes me five seconds, but I'll look at it on the next Sunday. Maybe I'm now a six, but it's still my area of work. Guess what? I'm going to continue there. And maybe in three weeks, I'm a nine. And then I notice that my reducing toxic load is lower. Then I'm going to go and start using my essential oils in that space. 
So the beautiful thing about this is that we're going to talk about the top 10 oils that you got in your kit just to make this easy. The only product that's going to be new and talked about is very quickly is going to be the Lifelong Vitality. Now the reason that I want to talk about Lifelong Vitality is the oils have absolutely no nutritional value. They are amazing, you know, polyphenol complexes and all of these things, but, and, and, you know, phytochemicals, but they're not nutritionally based. So when we talk about eating right, if your eating right is like a one, a two, a three, an eight, a six, whatever it is, if that's the area you feel you need the most work in, and remember that there is a reason why this is the foundational, like the foundational piece, nutrition is the building blocks of our cells. Essential oils are wonderful for cellular structures. They're detoxifying and all that fun stuff, you know, and they're protective and they do all these great things with ourselves. But nutrition, that's the building blocks. That's the things that we create ourselves with. And as a human species, it is our birthright to recreate cells through mitosis. And you want to be giving them the proper building blocks, which is a great thing. It means that you get to start over every few months sometimes. Our liver rebuilds itself every few months. Our nose rebuilds itself. All these things. So foundationally using the lifelong vitality probably your biggest impact in your health so if you are low on there this will be the first product I'm going to break it down in two seconds because I could talk about it and I am going to do a whole video on this separately but this bottle here is your nutritional so as a nutritional therapist I look for deficiencies I look for spaces where people are lacking so this is your nutrients a, uh, a to z your brain fog remover, I like to call it. So this guy right here is your fish oils. So in the proper dosage, as humans, we get way too much omega-6. And so this beautiful thing has a lot of omega-3s, which is something we are so lacking. Helps with joint health and nail health and hair health and heart health. Um, sound good, right? And then we have this beautiful product, which is one of doTERRA's most unique products. And this is the Alpha CRX, which is a combination of maximizing antioxidant protection. And that looks like things that help with cellular, um, the cellular damage. So just to talk about that, that's where you want to be starting if this was a one or a two or a three or a four, probably anything six, six and under, you want to be starting probably here. Now in your kit, you have all these beautiful essential oils. So let's talk about exercise. Let's talk about how you can support your body through exercise with essential oils. The reason exercise is so important is because when you're sweating, when you're, when you're getting your heart rate, when you're needing to heal um, and you need to do those things, exercising and getting your blood flow moving is extremely impactful to cells because all of them can move around your body to the areas that may need extra support. Those cells need to travel there. You know, you need those fighters to go to where they're supposed to go. Um, also very good for sweating when you want to get rid of certain substances in the body like heavy metals and things like that. So how do we use essential oils to support ourselves through our, our workouts or through our healthy weight or metabolism? So in your kits, you would actually be reaching for lemon. I would use lemon to drink, but we're going to talk about lemon when we talk about detoxifying. But lemon is wonderful for focus. So when I am exercising, whether I be doing something like yoga or something that is very high impact, I like it all. It's actually good to do it all. My cancer program really emphasized the benefits of different exercises. But you want to be focused. You want to feel that. So I either put it in my water or I will put just a little bit on the back of my neck so long as I know I won't be um, seeing the sun. The other essential oil that is amazing, 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 amazing for um, exercise, for motivation, <laughs> is actually peppermint. I love using peppermint. I breathe it in right before I either hop on the treadmill or I do such a thing. But um, one of the things that I'm going to talk about briefly about um, another option for that would be Easy Air. So this beautiful oil, Easy Air, is extremely, extremely impactful for airway opening. And so much of our exercise depletion happens when we get short of breath because we are running we are our endurance is not as high so using easy air on our chest to open up the airway if you think about yoga everything in yoga is geared and focused around breath life force as they call it in yoga it's amazing to use again easy air either in a diffuser on your chest just underneath your nose so easy air is a wonderful way to support good exercising um, lemon oil is also wonderful I like to say that it's my, because it is a detoxifier, um, very, very strong. And we're going to go into a little bit, uh, we're going to go into that a little bit later. But the great thing about it is that 
it helps with managing weight loss. It helps with managing um, just those cravings. So does peppermint. Peppermint is awesome to cut it back on, on sugar if that's one of your downfalls. And lastly, I think I would be shot if I, well, not literally, but I think I would be definitely um, way off if I didn't talk about deep blue. And deep blue oil is amazing pre-workout and also post-workout and to rub it into the areas that you know so if you're someone who's like a gym buff or someone who is doing more weight training this is a wonderful oil to help ready your muscles uh, prior to such a workout and also it's wonderful for when your workout is done even if you're running even if you know you're going to have some soreness deep blue is so soothing to the muscles to the joints it's just a soothing oil to help support all of that so it's very very supportive to that so now resting and managing stress okay this is actually a really important area we we highly don't realize that um really resting and focusing on these things is going to be impactful in every area of your life stress being the number one cause of disease is something that we ignore till it's too late often <coughs> a good example of that <coughs> is sleep. Most of us won't even sleep. Um, you know, we'll sleep six, five, we can run on four hours, so we say. There's actually, it's been proven you can't. I don't care how many times you say it. I used to say, I was like the that girl. I used to say, I'm going to sleep when I'm dead, so it's okay. I want to live my life to the fullest. But if you're not focused, if you're not clear, it, how are you living vitality and and energized and, and feeling the goodness of life. So um, resting and managing stress is super important. So in that pyramid space, what we would be using to support that is lavender. Lavender is one of my favorite essential oils to help reduce cortisol and do some rest management. Um, I also love to mix it again with easy air. Now guys, these are all things you have in your kit. Look at how much access you have to supporting that. So now these are spaces like in our diffuser, we use these two oils every single night. I also, on nights that I know I'm going to need a little bit extra support, I would throw in a drop of frankincense. And frankincense is extremely amazing for stress-related issues. It's so supportive to cellular function. It is just, I can't even tell you enough, but being high in aldehydes, it is a monoterpene, and that means that it works on a cellular level to really support and reset things to how they should be. Um, so resting and managing stress, those are some of the wonderful, um, impactful things you have in your kit. So how amazing is that? Another very protective oil for stress, if you are someone who feels very um, run down and overrun. Um, all right, and our, one of our next um, pillar in our pyramid is reducing toxic load. Um, it's really something that I know a lot of people don't believe in detoxification. I'm sorry, but that was one of the main things that actually supported our son through regressing autism. So you can tell me all you want that you don't believe in it, but I've seen it firsthand and it's extremely important. Our world has never had as much toxicity in it, and I know that might be hard for you, some people to understand, but um, we've created over 80,000 chemicals in the last 50 years, very minutely tested on humans. Uh, we have things coming off the shelf all the time because they realize how impactful it is to our cellular structure in a negative way. So detoxifying practices are necessary. Um, supporting our bodies so they can do them, to, so they could detoxify itself is what we're trying to do. So there are ways that we can do this out externally, and there are ways that we can do this internally. Um, externally, the beautiful thing about the oils is that we're going to use them the same way. Same oils for the same, um, both internally and externally for some, and some we would just use externally. So for example, to detoxify or to help support healthy digestive function, which is something we really, really do need, I like to use oregano. I use it only once a week and only for an adult. I use it in a capsule and I actually take it internally for 10 days as a cleanser of the bugs that could reside in there. You can buy the same kind of product that's synthetic. I love that I have something. This is nature's strongest natural antibiotic and in that time frame of 10 days you are actually fine with um, your gut flora. Now the second one that I'm going to talk about is actually on guard. Extremely, extremely supportive to, actually no, sorry, I'm gonna skip on on guard and I'm gonna talk about um, lemon essential oil. Lemon essential oil is a jam packed 
um, essential oil that is high in limonene or limonene, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's actually very important to the body because it's so supportive to the liver. It helps with just really getting rid of junk. If you want to know, um, my party trick used to be to put two drops of lemon in a styrofoam bottom of a styrofoam cup and watch the hole burn in it. Imagine how, how potent that has to be. And yet, when we put it on our skin, it's completely fine. It does not react that way. And why is that? Because we are organic and this is an organic matter. And so it actually only does this to toxicity and things that are inorganic. And in our bodies, where we keep our toxins is actually in our fat cells, which is why it's so supportive to a healthy metabolism. So I love, love, love to do that. Okay, tea tree oil is extremely, extremely um, supportive as well. I like to use it topically only, but if there is something um, to help cleanse the outer surfaces of your home, I my favorite combination for a homemade cleaner that is so simple to do and will save you so much money, guys, is to combine on guard tea tree, lemon, about five to 10 drops of each, depending on the size of your bottle with a little bit of white vinegar and water. So you've just like supported so much and it helps you to feel good about the fact that my kids can fall on their faces. I say this all the time. And at least I know that what they've fallen on is actually completely non-toxic and it probably cleans better than, well, I'm not gonna say probably, and it cleans better than any other chemical. Uh, Clorox, there's all these beautiful children who have done all these science projects of showing bacteria and how much the oils are, are impactful in cleaning. Now, the last area that I want to talk about is um, informed self-care. This is when you come across things like um, ailments or we call it the emergency situations. So when you get head tension, sore muscles, um, it can be when you actually are at that time of the year where you know, pollen's in the air and you have seasonal threats that affect your sinuses. Uh, these are what we call kind of emergency situations. Guess what? You have an arsenal in this informed self-care. Right now, as an example, I'm going to tell you that to support our healthy immune function being wintertime, I'm using a ton of On Guard topically on all of my children, myself, and I'm actually using it internally because I work frontline in healthcare. See a lot of pneumonias there. Things like Zengest, when you have anything dealing with um, anything kind of bowelish or even um, when you eat really spicy food and you can feel it. Anyways, it's hard to be compliant with this one. But yes, it's one of those beautiful oils that's really supportive to the, the digest digestive system. Now, um, emergency head tension peppermint. Deep blue for if it's super bad on the back of the neck, frankincense under underneath the roof of your mouth if it's like at the like I'm seeing things stage. Um, if you have those airway issues, what a wonderful thing to have easier and accessible to you. If you have seasonal threats, peppermint, la uh, peppermint, lavender, and sorry, I'm losing my stuff. Peppermint, lavender, and lemon are beautiful oils to use together. These are actually my, I put these in a shot glass. So informed self-care is the last one. I want to keep this short. I hope that that supports you guys, that you've gotten a beautiful kit. I hope that it makes you realize that by printing up this pyramid of health, you may realize just how easy it is to truly incorporate essential oils in your life because they are they are my healthcare right now. They are my prevention. And I will likely someday have to go see the doctor again, although I hope that it's in a very long time. And I am very confident that if I treat my body well, it's not going to happen that often unless it's for probably something pretty acute like an accident, which I hope never happens. But um, this is a great space. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Uh, make sure to share it with people so that they can have access and know just how easy it is to incorporate their kits into their lives so that they can become the health, the health provider or what do we call it? The solutions provider for their home.